A man called Adolf had helped train the lioness since she was a cub. Regrettably, the man later quit his job as a lion tamer and moved to another city. But eventually he came back. Kiara was very excited to see him. In fact, You'd never believe that the reaction of one of nature's fiercest predators at the sight of her old friend would be like that. It may scare you. But don't worry. All this cat wanted to do was play. There is a reason why the lion is called the king of the forest. They are apex predators. When the whole jungle is afraid of their presence. They have nothing to worry about. Those who go hunting are always advised to watch out for lions. Any close encounter with these beasts can be very dangerous. Not many people can survive and tell their experience after approaching a lion. On the other hand, although this is an exception, Kiara this lion, named Kiara, was trained by Adolf. The man found her in Mexico and rescued her. He took Kiara to a shelter and raised her. He showed the cub the skills needed to survive among the beasts. They are very close. But there was one question. Adolf took little Kiara to the wildlife sanctuary and named her after a character in The Lion King. He didn't leave her alone there. He helped raise and train her. Adolf considered himself to be Kiara's adoptive father. These two became very close. They had developed a beautiful story. That will be told to you today. Although the name was inspired by the animated character in The Lion King, Kiara has many meanings in different languages. In Italian, it means light. In Hindi, it means a precious gift from God. In Korean, it means first ray of sunshine. And all these meanings are exactly how Adolf feels about this precious lion. Kiara had been growing up. She could no longer fit into her first wildlife sanctuary. Adolf knew he had to make the difficult decision to send Kiara to a bigger and better place. As she was a lioness slowly coming of age. At this point Adolf informed the Black Panther White Tiger Foundation Sanctuary. As Kiara grew older, Kiara the Black Panther White Tiger Foundation accepted her. In 2013, businessman Eduardo Siria set up this foundation. After rescuing a jaguar cub, he named it Seattle. This poor pup was found in a pet shop in Monterey. The foundation aims to rescue and adopt as many felines as possible to ensure the best possible life for these beautiful felines. In this way, protected areas ensure that legal hunting is prohibited. How would Kiara adapt to her new home? Adolf took some photos and videos of himself and little Kiara, saying they would have to be separated. This was not only made him sad, but also made Kiara, who was with him every day, felt sad. A year later, a video of the two meeting went viral again. As time went on, Kiara started to get bigger and more fierce. Adolf, but she never forgot Adolf. This man had become friends with this lioness. Kiara had been waiting for him. Fortunately, Kiara's dream came true. A year had passed. Adolf and Kiara were separated. The lioness was now a fearsome beast. No one had the courage to go near her. However, she never forgot Adolf. When he came to see her, her love for him showed clearly. Adolf decided to go back to Panther White Tiger Park to visit Kiara. The fierce lioness heard his voice and became excited. The lioness couldn't believe it was Adolf's voice. She kept looking at the door, hoping it was really him. Seeing how excited the lions were, people advised Adolf not to go in. Do you think he would have listened to them? 
the man was still discussing with other zookeepers whether he should go in or not. But his decision had already been made. When he saw Kiara, he knew he had to get in. As Adolf was about to open the door, he changed his mind. Maybe Kiara didn't remember who he is. She might attack him. Wild animals may behave in unexpected ways. Growling and pacing may not be a welcome sign. So what did Adolf do? Adolf hoped Kiara didn't just remember his voice. If she forgot about him, he would be in danger. When he walked into her circle, was it worth the risk? Kiara exhausted all his knowledge of lions as a tamer. He finally chose to open the door. Adolf love overcame Adolf. His love for Kiara overcame common sense. When Kiara saw Adolf, she jumped on him, surprised her father. She threw him down on the ground. If you look at these photos out of context, you'd think she attacked him. But all Kiara did was hug her father. Adolf walked into Kiara's cage. The lioness jumped into his arms. Can you believe it? They looked like two old friends hugging each other. Adolf the big lioness won't let go of Adolf. He fell. But Kiara was still holding on to him. They fell together. She would never give up on her beloved best friend. Kiara was so excited to see her old coach. She jumped up and down on him. If there's one thing we can be sure of, it's that Kiara won't let go easily. Don't you think it's cute that this incredible beast was acting like a kitten around Adolf? It's not something you see every day. It showed us how strong the bond between a lioness and her tamer was. When Adolf walked into the cage, did you ever think this would happen? Looks like Adolf needed to get used to having a lioness around him. Because Kiara jumped on him every time he came to the zoo. Kiara was so excited to be with Adolf again. She started biting his jeans. Most people wouldn't want to go near a lioness. But Adolf was even comfortable enough to let one bite his leg. Isn't it incredible? Kiara was so happy to see her adoptive father. She showed off her jumping skills next to him. Adolf was very pleased with her reaction. He hadn't expected the meeting to be so intense. The big smile on Adolf's face showed his mood. It took Kiara about half an hour to calm down. She was sitting next to Adolf. Adolf was stroking her. This lioness was behaving like a house cat. Wasn't this crazy? It's one of the most incredible stories we've ever seen. Don't you think so? Kiara growled panting and chewing on her dad's clothes because she was so happy to see him again after such a long time. What were they doing now? Seeing this, the Foundation's trainers couldn't believe that such a dangerous animal could show so much love to a person she hadn't seen in a long time. The fact that lions usually come in packs should help Kiara to keep her love for Adolf. After all, Adolf was her father. Adolf's story continues. He updates Kiara's daily routine on social media, posting videos of them playing, cuddling, or relaxing in the sun. Adolf captioned his photos. My daughter will be six years old. In March this year. Undeniably. The bond between Adolf and Kiara is strong. Even if they were apart for a few months. The video of their reunion has gone viral around the world. It has helped raise awareness of the wildlife sanctuary. Thanks to these heartwarming moments. Adolf has helped raise awareness of the endangerment of lions. And why species conservation must be supported. Adolf continues to visit the reserve where he meets the other cubs he helps. He's in the shade with these big cats. 
Isn't that a picture you rarely see? Adolf is not the only one with a special relationship with the big cats.